The single most important factor that is uniting Nigeria is the candidacy of P2B Ahmed Dati. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Ahmed Dati, the vice presidential candidate of the Labour, has stated that the candidacy of P2B is uniting Nigeria. He made a statement on channels television this morning when asked by the interviewer about the singular message that he and his principal have been projecting so far. His words from 115 seconds to 209 seconds presently, it gives hope and it is already uniting Nigerians in advance. You can see that at certain nationalities, as we call it in Nigeria, even though we are one nation, certain groups feel that their efforts, including others, is to make theirs come to power. You can see that the tension is coming down. There's a lot of hope for a better or better security, for a better life or better security, and already Nigeria is uniting. The single most important factor uniting Nigeria is the candidacy of P2B, if you read in between the lines. Uh, let me say this. Um, let me say this sincerely. The way in this Oga talk here, Nahimbi, Nahimbi, what they call Kaji, what they say, Yowa, Nahimbi, you don't talk and you don't hit the nail for the head. And why I'm saying this is because Obi's candidacy, though we have people who are not supporting him more, but I want to tell you a good percentage of the northeast, the northwest, the north central, the southeast, the southwest, and the middle belt are all out for this particular man. And you know, B is not coming and riding on the wings of ethnicity. Yo. No, no, no. He's ever going to places where he said, say, make him no go. As in, places where he's so ordinary, he's not supposed to go because eh, this place is not to. These people, they will not vote for you. No, he goes there. He goes there. You're correct, but for P2B to be popular in the North, you have to be. You have to be having press conferences as a North and so that the North will trust the movement through you. Thanks, up it will be up Yusuf Dati Baba, up Labour Party. All right, he that is making moves, but every action taken must not be in the public domain. Oh, okay. This Dati I made is very, very smart. P2B is now like our national team, Super Eagles. Hmm. All right. Um, Obi Dati Candice is the hope and inspiration that is the life warrior of unity of all Nigerians. Every true Nigerian issue needs. The, to connect to keep Nigeria as one. And why I'm saying this is actually true is that do you know that if at the end of the day P2B wins this election, who then go call them? They're not going to say, eh, it is the South East Youth that made it happen. No, would they come and say, ah, it is those from the South South or it is those from the South West or it is those from the North Central? No. Wait till then go talks or people when they go talk say make this possible na Nigerian youth. That unity will decree for. It will no longer be a thing of na this one, no be this one, na this one, no be this one. To me, sincerely, no, <laughs> Dr. Ahmed, you really hit the nail on the head right here. Yes, I cannot agree with him less. I definitely cannot agree with him, yes. They will not come out to say See people wear dwan or see people who advertise and because everyone, every of the rally or the one million match that has happened in the past, not be only one people dwan. People will come outside for that one million match. They're not only people from one from one region. You know, everybody's coming to give their two cents to make sure that we'll have not just a president who is ready to take Nigeria out of this its, its problem, but a president that is going to come in and unify the country. So Nigerian people know it's your candidate detribalized. What is his plan on uniting the country together? How in the use one? What is his plan on making Nigeria a better country? How will he go about it? Enough of the rhymes, enough of telling a super story and more of action. Okay? Yes, and in, about why he's saying that you can see the tension is coming down. Yes, the indigenous people of Biafra. I think it's only me 
I don't know say some people have noticed that these people, they do not come. Before now, you would have heard powerful coming out, you know, to speak. and, But all of a sudden, people are seeing what they are seeing now. And they're like, no, we never see this kind of thing before. We don't know sin as we go be you. We never ever thought. I want to tell the people, had they been that the indigenous people of Biafra saw this coming, they go don't quit, they go don't turn down the agitation for a very, you know, go start now. That is why people are coming out to say, eh, it is the Biafrans, that is the indigenous people of Biafra, that is actually spearheading this campaign. Why? Because nobody is hearing their voice again. They are not coming out to say, you know, this one happened and that one happened. No, they are not. So, yes, it is dousing a lot of tension. And I just hope that, you know, not just the tension, but a whole lot of things that is not supposed to, that is supposed to, be, that is supposed to have been stopped, you know. All right. You say it gives hope and it is already uniting Nigerians in advance. We can see that as certain nationalities, as we call it in Nigeria, even though we are nation, we are nation, certain groups feel that the effort, including others, is to make theirs come to power. Hmm. Sincerely, it makes sense very, very well. It makes a whole lot of sense, if you ask me. So, Nigeria, make we make sure, say, we pick somebody, we be say, in idea clear. In idea very crystal clear. We be say, even come in at the end of the day, and go make Nigeria better. We go walk. What did he say he go do? Nahim in Gudu. All right. The single most important factor uniting Nigeria is the candidacy of P2B, if you read behind the lines. Well, uh, at the end of the day, we should just make sure we pick somebody devoid of. Devoid of, of uh, what's it called? Should um at the end of the day, um what's it called? At the end of the day, we are going to be able to do what we vote for the right person first of all. Make sure we vote for the right person. Make sure we um. All right, well, at the end of the day, we should make sure we vote wisely and uh, we should know that uh, everything at the end of the day, we want, we just want, you know, we don't have another opportunity aside from this one. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day. Mm.